what the fair price is, is depends on who you ask. If you ask industry, you would like, of course, to have return of investments. So they make a lot of uh, R and D, uh, so they ask in general higher prices. But when you ask patients or doctors, a fair price is the price that every patient have access to the drug, and then. The, the, the main issue is to find a balance between what's fair for one stakeholder and for the other stakeholders, actually. So for patients and industry. Now the after ten project is about uh, improving access for patients. But what we, what we see is that many new therapies are on the market, are quite expensive, and not, uh, patients don't have access. So we want to improve uh, the, the access for patients and also improve sustainability and affordability. Of these new therapies. Uh, these therapies sometimes cost 100,000, 300,000, some cell gene therapies on millions. Um, so we have to look how we can um, improve that situation and we will do that by this, um, developing new models for pricing, cost effectiveness and uh, budget impact and also reimbursement. The mission of Astertain is to improve accessibility and sustainability across Europe. So for all European countries, not only focusing on the Western or the richer countries, also on Eastern European countries. The main issues of the price of CAR is that the prices are quite high and not affordable in many countries. Many countries patients don't have access. Uh, the high prices are related to high research and development costs, but also we know that many products are first uh, developed in, in academia, so also public funding. So there is there are some challenges how to, to, to solve that, that, that kind uh, of uh, investment as, as, as well. Um, but the procedure is also a rather complex. Um, you, you need highly specialized centers, uh, highly uh, specialized uh, clinicians, um, but also you have pre and post period. It's just giving a pill and the patient went to the, to the hospital, uh, but you need a whole, there's a whole process. So that also takes uh, cost money. So you're not we don't have to reimburse only the, the costs of the CAR T, but also of the, the, the pre uh, infusion costs and host uh, costs related to side effects and so on. And it could also add up to 50 to 80,000 euros as well. Look, we, we see some solutions. Uh, we see that also uh, production in house uh, is that happening in academic hospitals. So that can lower the price maybe up to 80,000 instead of 300, 400,000. Um, but I don't think that's a real a solution because you also want to stimulate innovation. And innovation is mostly targeted by, by industry. Um, but by having a project like Ascertained, just to be in discussion also with pharma about pricing, what's a fair price, use that price as input for your models, also for cost effectiveness, ACA and reimbursement. We hope that, that the, the, the access is, is, uh, the, is, is faster and when having access, faster access in, in countries, this also our revenue for, for industry. If you have to wait two to three years in a country for getting reimbursement, there's also a lot of money for industry as well. So I hope for lower prices, but faster access, that in the end, the revenue for the industry is, 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 is maybe about the same.